Hi folks, it's Nick here, and we're on the uh, Sega Mega Drive Ultimate Collection on the PlayStation 3, published by Sega in 2009. This time we're going to have a look at Streets of Rage 2, we'll be having a look at quite a lot of games on this collection over the coming weeks. It's a beat em up, it came out on the arcades in 1992, but also come out on the Sega Genesis, Game Gear, Master System, the PlayStation Network and 3DS. It's uh, a 2D horizontal beat em up, uh, highly regarded in retro circles, so well worth a look. There's not too much of a storyline to speak of, um, you can read it if you want, but it's a year after the original game, after we defeated Mr. X, the uh, villain of the beast, but he's now kidnapped one of our friends, Adam Hunter, yes, and uh, we've got to now rescue him by going over a number of stages and kicking everyone's heads in. Brilliant. Uh, the game introduces a couple of new characters, uh, Eddie Skate Hunter, the younger brother of Adam Hunter who's been kidnapped, and a chap called Max Funder. I don't know if he's got wind problems or something. There he is, Mr. X. Ooh, Streets of Rage 2. As I said, a classic amongst many uh, in a few people's top tens from 1992. I never owned a Sega Mega Drive, but we're looking at this because it's on the PlayStation 3, which I, I did own. There's supposed to be an HD remake of the originals. How close it is, I don't know, so let me know if they're close or nowhere near. We'll do this on a normal mode. So here's our characters. We've got Max, Axel, Blaze, or Skate. Uh, I think we controlled Adam Hunter in the original um, Streets of Rage, which I reviewed a little while ago, or a couple of weeks ago. Here we go. Now, this game differs from the first one in that um, before, you had a special move where a police car would come in and fire a missile at everyone. Uh, this hasn't got that to my knowledge, but the gameplay is quite similar. Punching, kicking, jumping and kicking, demolishing stuff for um, power-ups and money. Time ticking up down in the middle, but we'll start off on the streets here. Street of Rage, you see the power bar of my enemies, or the main enemy there. He's dead, right, here we go, boof. Dunk, that place says. This is good, bit of perspective. Sometimes the guys just wait for you to turn up. Uh, you have to hit a certain bit of the screen sometimes before they come into action, so if you walk too far forward, you're fighting too many people and it becomes difficult. Now, much easier on two player this, as all of these are, all the Streets of Rage and Golden Axe 2, when it's just you on your own, it's a little bit trickier. Although I think there are more people to fight when you are on two player. Can we get off stage one? Well, I hope so, because there's a few credits here. But I'll just see how far as I can get. It won't be a complete walkthrough. It'll be me playing a little bit rubbish. There's a bit of food there to replenish my energy. Go, go, go. What could possibly go wrong? Go, Axel. Smash a roulie. Right, we've got a knife here we can pick up, hopefully. There we go. So we can use that for stabbing actions. Oh, we, dro we dropped it for some reason. Pick that up. Stab. That's it. Is he dead? No. Stab, 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 stab him. Oh, come on, get in the way of my stabbing device. Good, he did. Go, go, go. You can only go one direction in this. Um, a lot of uh, repeats in the villains, and there's a pipe you might recognise from the first game, which we can use to clobber people. And that gives us a little bit of range, which does help. Clobber, clobber. Is he going to get clobbered? Yeah, we threw him instead. Right, good. So graphics are very, very, very similar to the first one, aren't they? Music is good. Chip techno sort of music. Go Axel. V can't do it. No one always. Does. Oh dear! What's this guy just walking across with a? It's like when they say don't walk along with um, uh, scissors the wrong way around, and that's that's why. So he's dropped. He's dropped the knife. There's Moeekan Bob there, whatever his name is. Ah. Right. Oh, I wanted the pipe, really. Let's get the pipe somehow. Yep, just on screen. Clobber. Good. The stages are quite big in this. I think I think this stage we go into a bar at some stage, I think. And then there should be a, a date waiting for us. Uh, she's not very friendly, though, from memory. We'll soon find out. I might be getting mixed up with Streets of Rage 3, which we'll come to as well. But I guess that's quite similar to this, too. Did you have this game on any system? Because I mainly had the Spectrum and Commodore Amiga, uh, it was, uh, Double Dragon was the, the, the game that's all I played. I never played Double Dragon in the arcades or this in the arcades either, but there's a lot of competition. Oh look, right, could this be the end of level bosses? It seems like a bit of a bigger guy. 
Looks a little bit like Vivian from The Young Ones, if you know that show from the 80s. Aid Edmondson. I don't think he is Aid Edmondson, though. He's taunting me. Uh, <laughs> right, okay. Flying kick, I think, for him. And short range there. Right. So I'm doing my special uh, move, it says. I pre I'd prefer... I did like the um, the special move on the first game, where the police car came in and fired a missile. Uh, hasn't got that here as far as I'm aware. Certainly not with this character. I like the change in perspective when you're going down the street, which uh, looks like it's going to happen after we kill him. It seems to be angled that way, unless this is the end. Let's beat this Jack person. Four life left. Headbutt. Yeah, flying kick. You need to get in close with this guy. That's him dead, I think. Yep, and he disappears. Right, okay, yeah, we're into the bar. It's quite a welcoming bar. I'm sure they'll uh, buy me a drink or something. Ah. Ah. Good job they're not fighting all together. It's a bit more crawler in Golden Axe where they attack quite quickly. Here, a lot of people are just uh, watching for a bit. Come on. Did Final Fight come out on the, uh, the Sega... Um, Mega Drive, I presume it did. Uh, I would have liked to have seen that on this um, this disc, but I don't think it's there. About 40 games are on this. Uh, there's some special ones to unlock, like Space Harrier, so I might look at that one next week. A few of you have suggested some of the better ones on there. Uh, the Sonic, the Vector Man. Um, yes, I, I will uh, try and come to those too. We'll be doing one a week some money there. Money, money. That might help for my date at the bar. Not a very friendly place. No one's got any drinks. There's no, like, a broken glasses or bottles anywhere. Nice gentle music in this place. No bouncers, which they need. It's nice, well, well decorated. Oh, and another guy. Put put a top on, you twit. It's not that warm. Ah, this reminds me a little bit. This seems a bit like the, the Moonwalker, uh, graphics, or the setting at least. Maybe I'm remembering it wrong. Oh, is Michael Jackson going to come in and moonwalk below that light? Oh, I don't think he does in this. You can smash the furniture if you're that way inclined. Let's smash a few things. Boof. Got a table? Yeah, that's smashed as well. Right, there's my date at the bar, I think. Where is she? There she is. Sorry I'm late, girl. Oh dear, this is, uh, this is worst date ever. Mind you, I've had worse. Tough luck. Well, I'm not buying her a drink. This date's got off quite badly. I've got an apple for you if you want. No. Okay. The barman doesn't seem to be helping too much. So if you ever turn up for a date and there's someone there with um, high boots on and a whip that tries to kill you, you'll probably get away. And that, that goes if you're a man or a woman. Um, yeah. Right, her health pass not going down too uh, quickly. Her name is Electra. Punt, punt, biff, off. Where's where's Mr. X and what's what's your uh, part in this? There's a piano there. I don't think you can go down and play that. And she's dead with a, a piercing scream. Is that the end of the stage? Stage goes on forever. Oh, look at that. That's good. Look at that rain. Lovely. That's a nice effect. Right, there's a bloke in a karate gear there. When's he going to come to life? Don't want to antagonise him too much, and I've been kicked onto the bit which has activated him. Uh, this is going to be awkward now. Where's player two? Player two alert. Call for player two. If you can get round here quickly and become player two before I've uh, reviewed and uploaded this, then please do so. I'm not sure how you're going to do that, but it will come in helpful. Oh, I'm going to get my butt kicked now. Especially by that big guy. If I can take her out all these little minion people, it might have a bit of a chance. How tall is that guy? He's about eight foot tall. Yeah, okay. Right, two lives left. How long is this going to go on for? Right, good. Save that chicken for a little bit. Boof. Man, I got thrown big time there. Yeah. Oh, man, okay. Right, my, my energy's less than him. I'm going to need that chicken in a minute. Get out of the way of my chicken. Good. This is not going well. Got plenty of time, but not much energy. Good. He's not losing much uh, strength each time I do that. Good. Right. Two attacks in a row. One more. And I was using my special move then. 
Have you got a special move? What's your special move? Let me know. Yes. Tough luck, sir. He's dead. It's raining as well. Stage one clear. Right, so stage one's huge, isn't it? I think all the stages are quite big, and it's quite interesting. It gives you different environments for each stage. I love that. Brilliant game, this. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Classic action. Stage two. Right, there's bound to be stuff in these barrels. There's money there. Let's pick that up. Don't know what that was I picked up. But same sort of thing again all the way through the game. Looks like we're going over some sort of bridge. Is it the Golden Gate Bridge? Is it just a random bridge? And there's motorbike men. Oh no, doing stunts. This is going to be difficult. Am I going to get run over about 100 times? Hopefully not. No, the motorbikers are gone now, it seems. Die. No, he's got up again. Stay down. Stay down, sir. It's better for everyone. Right, that's that. I hope they're getting paid a lot by Mr. X. Whatever he's doing. I don't know why Mr. X keeps kidnapping people. I think he's obsessed with taking over the city. He wants to be mayor or something. Check out this music. It's gone all a bit weird. Another mo- Oh no, I've got run over. They are back. I think it's quite difficult to knock the guys off their bikes when they come in, but if you time it right, you can't steal their bike or anything. Oh, right, a pipe. That's going to help. Right, now, people are going to get clobbered. Oh, his bike's blown up. Look at those clothes that chap's wearing. What club's he from? Woof. Storm. I'm going to give you a storm, mate. There you go. Oh no, it's Biker City on this bridge. And I've dropped my pipe again. Oh man, give us a break, dudes. Uh oh. Oh, I'm losing all my strength now. Oh man, how'd you knock these guys off their bikes? Maybe they'll blow up at some point. This isn't good. Right, is he off his bike now? Some bike did skid in there. There's one more guy at the top. What's that? That might have been an extra life there. That piper helped. Good. Oh, we can't keep doing this throughout the game, surely. There's an, oh, there's, this, this stage is criminal. There must be a timing involved in this one. I'll get it by random in a minute. Jump. I've got to jump right at the right time to connect with their face and knock them off their bike. Nice bit of blur there as they go through, so um, good. Cost me about a life and a half though, isn't it? Right, I think I just heard the bike blow up, so good. You can pick up that pipe a few times, but once you're um, knocked off, it, well, punched over, it will disappear. And there's more bikers. Right, that's one off. One more is there. Oh, he's jumped off the bike naturally. Good, well done. That's a bit of luck. This is my last life now. Oh dear. Well, I, as I said to you, it wasn't going to be a complete walkthrough. I just wanted to show you how it played. And we've given you all the moves. There's not too much variety, but it's just nice different sounds each stage. And it's pretty addictive gameplay, really. You don't have to think about it too much. And I think that's why it was pretty popular, really. Like all of these ones, Final Fight, Double Dragon, Streets of Rage, they give you a basic story, normally involving some uh, super arch nemesis person or evil villain, uh, and then you have to beat everyone up that under his employ, and often rescue someone that's been kidnapped. Always the case. Ooh, ooh. These guys are quite bad. I like, um, although the graphics are quite similar with the villains, they do give them different colour clothes. Right, is this a bonus stage? I don't know what those two chaps are up to. Can we fight them? No, they seem to be locked into the wall. Save the apple for a moment. And now we've got some um, end of level boss guy. Which I'm going to make short work of. Hopefully. Oh yeah, this guy's a lot easier to beat than the last chap. This is some sort of electronics room, is it? Look at that, he didn't even get near me. Oh, now all these other chaps have jumped to life. Uh, we've got the, about four of the bikers. Oh, and another, another uh, Karate Superman. Right, if I can get him one on one, I think I'll be able to beat him quite easily without too much hassle. Different music again. Is that then done? Right, there's just this guy now. 
And he's already had, he's got half an energy bar left. Have you completed this one? Let me know. What happens at the end? Does Mr. X blow up if you fight him? Does he go into a robot or a pussycat? Boom. Is that stage two done? Or is it going to another area? No, it's another area. So we're still on stage two, folks. Uh, they're on the other side of the bridge. So we've got some, looks like some roadworks going on. Take me to the bridge. Look at the lights flickering there. That's a nice touch. Nice uh, cityscape in the background. We're crossing the bridge of town. I guess this is over a river or something. Can't seem to blow that one up. We'll pick that one. Die, sir. He's quite a... Uh, he works out a bit, doesn't he, this guy, Axel? Ah. He likes saying ah a lot as well. It's going to give him a sore throat in the morning. These guys just never learn. This My chap is just too good at fighting. Good, good, good. Go. Nice haircut, sir. Boof. So, uh, yeah, you can do punches and kicks, but um, it seems to random what you do depending on your, your um, vicinity of the opponent. Opponent? Yes, that's it. That's it. It's well done. Flying kicks and jumps. Right, we've got to get off this bridge and then it's the end of level DOS. That was Sorga we just killed really. Oh, hello, who's this? There's a jet person turned up. Oh, that's that's nasty. I've been picked up on power drive. That's gonna be pretty painful. Yeah, what's the timing of this? Ah. Uh yeah, this person's gonna be a bit hard to beat, I think. Get down here, oh. I don't want to fight someone with a jetpack on unless it's Boba Fett, because then it's cool. This could be my undoing, this. I haven't even hit them once yet. Yes, no. Yes, right, once. Well, they didn't take much damage, did they? Need to get them at ground level and do a bit of fisticuffs in their face. Good, right, that's two. God, that energy's going down really slowly. And that's a hell of a pun. Oh dear. That's it. It's game over. It's game over. Well, I think we've seen enough of that one. Um, Streets of Rage 2. I really, really liked it. Makes me wish to go back in time and have a, a Mega Drive there. But this is the Sega Mega Drive collection on the PlayStation 3. Published by Sega in 2009. Based on Streets of Rage, of course, from 1992. Hope you liked having a look at that one. Thanks for watching as always. If you've got any comments about this game, the Sega Mega Drive, the uh, games on the collection itself, then please put them below. Until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fun. Goodbye. Goodbye.